so today we are going to be looking at a super soaker battery 60 volt 30 amps lithium sorry amper hours here 71.4 so it's not 60 volt it's 63 volt and it says sometimes the battery cuts out during the load and they had a moped in uh, at the service center and they checked the bike they wanted to check the battery but we do not have diagnostic tools but we can always Okay, now it's flashing red and green, no instructions, but there isn't a charging problem. And what does green mean? I know it's red, so it's probably charging. Let's check the connector, in the, it seems to be using all pins, slight water damage in the bottom. And that could be a problem, but since it's not a charging problem, and since there are no water damage visible here, uh, I don't think it, that's a problem, but uh, if there's water on the charging port, maybe it's water inside. Yeah, someone already opened it up, so it's not a virgin anymore. So... don't recall if it had a super soaker battery in before but then it's probably a different model I wonder if it's screwed onto the bottom why else would there be screw terminals no that's just for keeping the case and I don't know what that, that must be a battery lock that's the only thing that makes sense Let's see if we can slide this out. It does have quick connector, but why does it have fake Amas? No, that's a year real Amas connector, the bottom one, but this one is a fake one. That's weird. <laughs> can that afford the whole set? Um, okay, here it has four wires, but there's just three ones going into. I don't know what cells they're using. The color indicates LG, but I don't think it's LG. Let's see if it slides out. No. So unscrew. Okay, rubber mat. have to pull it out and is it silicone maybe that's holding it in what are these yeah, I think it's silicone there shouldn't be any problem cutting I'm not sure if it's on the sides. I think I felt it move. No screw. Yeah, here we go. Here we have a fastening screw. Do we have one on the other side? Yes. Oof. It's a heavy beast of a battery. Look at those screws. They're having screws go all through the battery, hold it in place. And here goes the screw, so we have to align it perfectly. Still no indication on what cells it is, just a QR code and uh, something written in the bottom. My guess is maybe Buck. I have actually no idea who makes these kind of cells. And here we have the BMS and I saw something flashing and open it up. I can't see it now. Or maybe it stopped flashing. But no water damage so far. This feels a little funky. Maybe it's folded. Remove the tape and have a look. Yeah, I have some kind of bus bar technique. Which works it's pretty cool never seen this exact build definitely machine built 
so that's why it's a little bit flimsy very similar to the new BMS it does say TP here which indicate it might be 10 power cell maybe even 10 power that built the battery or this is just a reference to the cell TP ENR 18650 HE2 it does have the same two row GST as new but that's probably common can we even remove this I think the cells are in the way yeah we can do some measuring we can measure this if we're careful you see here are the black here are the red so I guess it's one for each side they do not necessarily have to be in order the temperature sensors are on a separate one but uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 13 all of these are not connected because that would be 26 you only need 18 why do we have AC? I guess we have to jump here we have something nothing stable near 7.8 that sounds like two cell groups so I'm guessing we should have the same here then yeah 7.8 nothing maybe that's a blank one nothing 7.8 7.8 very balanced nothing I think we do have to do a mesh on the cells let's see where all these wires are going yeah here we should have all the terminals and since we have positive here and 17 I can't remember where do we have negative we have negative here okay shouldn't be an even number of cells okay let's try and get the full voltage much easier 66.8 so let's do one at a time 3.9 3.9 3.9 3.9 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, and where do we have? Okay, it goes over like that. I think that's a split cell group. So we should have the next one here. Yeah, 3 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 3.9, 